This is Cheryl Hope Specialist. Here we are at a natural environment, totally natural. This is what supports life on Earth, supports you and supports me. It is also the hope for all of us, as we are the hope for each other. Today we're going to interview someone who knows, Chris Haskell, but I want to remind you that Chris has been talking to us for over 10 years, alerting you to what is happening to our natural environment. We need this natural environment to live. It's beautiful. Breathe. Breathe in and breathe out and enjoy the natural environment for it will lift your spirits. It will lift you to the heights that you need to go to deal with anything that you need to deal with as a human being. Hi, this is Cheryl Hope Specialist and we're in a very natural environment here with uh, some other neighbors of Chris that would like to tell you what he means to them and what they know about Chris. This is all this, this search for who is the real Chris Haskell. Chris Haskell, the filmmaker, he is a humanitarian, and he is the kid trail man, the signed Avenger. Hi. Hi. So how do you do, Chris? We, uh, we own the cabin next door to the Haskell cabin and we met Chris probably four to five years ago and uh, we see him up here all the time he's always up here working on the cabin and he's a worker uh, he's a worker and he's, he is he's, a workaholic <laughs> yes he is <laughs> he's, uh, he's always uh, been up here improving the cabin we've been up quite a bit improving ours and mm -hmm. uh, at the same time he's He's been working on his pretty much full time. We've met his uh, his dad. Uh, has been up here, the Haskell Senior, and uh, enjoyed knowing them. And uh, they've been great, great neighbors. And uh, Chris did. Uh, we had an incident years ago where I had a, a medical situation at our cabin. It was just my wife and I that were here, and uh, I was. Uh, we had to call 911. I was in just severe agony, and she came running out and yelled to Chris. And Chris shot right over and was right there to help us. and uh, And he helped us get get uh, get 911 up to the cabin and and get loaded and into the ambulance and make our way down. So he was Excellent. very helpful with Excellent. that. Did you know that Chris was involved uh, in warning people about kid trails and geoengineering? We we did. We we learned that after we met Chris up here and after we wondered what these signs were about, he explained them to us and gave us a, a bit of an education on uh, what that was all about and his passion about uh, what that meant to him and and uh, so yeah, that was our really our first. Um, Introduction. Introduction to yeah. that. Yeah. So, what did that information mean mean to you? And what what did it tell you, or uh, how did it influence your life, maybe? Well, it opened the door uh, for us to to do a little research on it, and uh, so we looked into it, and and uh, I think we learned that it was a you know a uh, worthy cause that he was involved in, and and. Uh, Certainly was very passionate about it, and uh, so we were impressed with that. Yeah. Were you aware that um, Chris is now being prosecuted, and he'll be going to trial? We did know a little bit about that. And uh, how how do you see that? Well, personally, I don't know exactly the reasoning behind it. Um, I, I just know that Chris has been a great, great neighbor. Somebody just such a worker and such a person that I can personally depend on. And um, I just feel like he's a rock. And um, as far as the the other stuff goes, <laughs> you know, I haven't um, really known about it. I I personally didn't do any research on it. But um, I can see Chris's passion, and his whole heart goes into what he believes. So whatever he's being prosecuted for, I, I do not know. I knew 
I knew something was going on. He was in trouble, but I didn't know what for. Right. Anything you'd like to like to add about uh, either the geoengineering or Chris being a side avenger, or or the uh, the current charges? Anything else you'd like to add? Well, we we probably don't know the the whole depth of you know what what the charges are. I mean, most of what we've heard is hearsay, really up up on the mountain. Chris has talked to me a little bit about it, and and it just doesn't seem uh, like uh, you know something that uh, Chris, as far as we know, Chris uh, would would be uh, involved in uh, at least what the apparent charges are. So we were a little surprised to hear that, but. Um, we certainly, uh, uh, you know, uh, wish him the best in in whatever, uh, however this goes. And and again, uh, it's just a, a surprise to us to see that uh, these kind of charges were being leveled against him based on who we know him to be. Right, right. Well, I thank you so much for for meeting with me today and, and doing the interview. I know, I know you're in a hurry and I really appreciate you coming. <laughs> this is Cheryl Hope Specialist and we're here to support Chris Haskell who has supported all of us for over 10 years and warning us about chemtrails and geoengineering. And at the bottom of the video you'll have an opportunity to support Chris. He does need to fund his defense and you'll have an opportunity to go into PayPal and make a donation. But we're also asking for all of your support, sending the healing energy, opening hearts, opening understanding and wisdom, and sending your prayers in this situation. We thank you for listening, and listen again, because we'll be talking to other people about who is the real Chris Haskell.